welcome to simplified engineering this is video lecture number two different types of interaction between system and surroundings in the last video lecture we explained the concept of system surroundings and system boundary now we are going to explain different types of interaction between system and surroundings interaction is nothing but some kind of an exchange so we will see different types of interaction that there are two types of interaction first one is mass interaction second one is energy interaction here we are looking for mass interaction first so what is meant by mass interaction mass is moving from system to surroundings or from surroundings to the system if the mass is moving from surroundings to the system then we will call it as mass is into the system likewise if the mass is moving from system to surroundings then it is called mass out of the system it is simply the exchange some amount of mass will be in the surroundings now it is going to the system then it is mass into the system and some amount of mass will be inside the system and if it is going to the surrounding then it is called mass out of the system so i will explain this concept with a simple example consider a jar with the opening at the right bottom side and which is covered with a lid this is our system now this is our system is empty everything outside our system that's a complete blue screen is the surroundings consider a jar containing liquid in, in our surroundings now that mass of liquid is in our surroundings now i'm pouring the mass of liquid to the system that means the mass is moving into the system from surroundings now look the mass is completely inside our system okay the mass is transferred from surroundings to system and now it is completely inside our system now i am going to open the lid so what will happen through that opening all the water will go outside like this okay so the liquid will be completely drained this is mass moving outside the system mean from our system the mass is moving outside the mass is moving to the surroundings so this is mass is move out of the system okay now i'm hope you understand the concept of mass interaction with system and surroundings now i'm going to explain the concept of energy interaction with system and surroundings like mass interaction there are two possibilities the mass can move from surroundings to the system and en the energy can move to from to the system or energy can leave system to surroundings means energy into the system means energy is moving from surroundings to system likewise energy is moving if energy is moving from system to the surroundings it is called energy out of the system okay means some amount of energy is there in the outside means surroundings now i am putting that an amount of energy into the system then it is energy into the system then that energy or uh, some other energy in the system it is going to the surroundings then it is energy out of the system so consider a pan this is our system we use this pan to boil water or making tea and all so this is our system everything outside the system is surroundings of the system now i'm going to heat this pan using a burner so what is happening i'm he using heat energy to heat the pan so energy is going from surroundings to the system this is energy into the system after supplying the heat energy what will happen the pan will get will pan will get heated so the heated pan will dissipate energy like this as we know if a, if we are touching a heated pan heat will be transferring from pan to our body that's why we are feeling very hot okay from the pan the energy will be transferred to the surroundings this is heat is moving that is heat energy is moving from out of the system means heat energy is moving from pan to the surroundings this is energy out of the system okay i hope you understand what is meant by energy into the system and energy out of the system these types of interaction may occur simultaneously or at different time means th the mass may be entering at once and mm, the mass may not be leaving at all S likewise energy is entering energy energy may not be leaving at all sometimes the both will happen together means energy is also enter and energy will also leave this kind of interaction we will be covering in detail in coming lectures so next video is types of energy interaction 
there are two types of energy interaction first one is heat interaction and the second one is work interaction these heat interaction and work interaction will be explained in coming lectures in detail with the suitable examples you can subscribe for latest videos thank you for watching